Here in London, a message went out from Kensington Palace just before 2.30 this afternoon, informing us that the Princess of Wales had been admitted for abdominal surgery with advice that she was going to be in the hospital for between 10 to 14 days. New photos, the scene at Kate's Hospital today. Police officers, reporters and photographers all stationed outside. We understand that the Prince of Wales has cancelled all of his immediate engagements for the forthcoming days and weeks while his wife is in hospital. The mother of three, who celebrated her 42nd birthday last Tuesday, looked healthy and fit during her last public appearance 23 days ago on Christmas. Whatever it was that they had to remove was not cancerous, which is obviously a huge relief to hear. But she won't be returning to official engagements, most likely until after Easter. This has been quite a major surgery. Abdominal surgeries could include an appendectomy, a cyst, hernia repair, or colon surgery. Kate herself asked that her personal medical details remain private. The length of days and the length of recovery makes you think that perhaps this was something that could have required more of an open type of procedure as opposed to, say, just laparoscopic. And that adds on time. Just one hour and 46 minutes after the palace revealed Kate's hospitalization, another surprise. It revealed that King Charles will undergo a corrective procedure in the hospital next week after seeking treatment for an enlarged prostate. Again, we've been told that this is benign. It's non-cancerous, but it is a condition that needs treatment. His engagements for the next couple of weeks will probably be under review depending on how quickly the king recovers.